Hi, welcome to the M Kitchen. I'm Pete and I'm going to show you how to make a fantastic spinach pistachio stuffed breast of lamb. The breast is taken from the belly of the animal and cooked slowly. It's a really tasty cut. Let's make the stuffing. To a hot frying pan, I'm going to add half the oil. Add the chopped onion, just fry until it softens. This may take four to five minutes. Once it's softened, add the garlic. and fry for a further one minute. Then add the baby spinach to the pan. And wilt it down. Now it's wilted, place it into a bowl on one side. Now we're gonna add the pistachio nuts, the breadcrumbs, the rosemary and half of the mint. Mix and season. So place your first breast of lamb shiny side down on the board. Down the centre, place the stuffing. Spread it out nice and evenly. Then top with the second breast of lamb. Roll away from yourself, long ways. And to tie, turn it upside down. Take your string, tie your first knot. And remember, when handling raw meat, to wash your hands. Don't worry about the stuffing coming out at the end. This will give you the really nice crispy bits while it's cooking. So let's roast the lamb. I always ask the butcher for the bones from the breast. I place this in the bottom of the roasting tray. It acts as a trivet and just raises it and allows it to cook more evenly. Place the lamb on top. Season well with salt and pepper. Place it in the oven for 40 minutes, remove and turn, and roast for a further hour and a half. Meanwhile, let's make the couscous. I've roasted some butternut squash for about half an hour with some olive oil. And the soaked couscous. I'm gonna crumble in some lovely feta. and add the rest of the chopped mint. And season with a little bit of salt and pepper. Gently mix together. How simple is that? Once cooked, I've rested my lamb for 20 minutes. I've loosely covered it with foil. Resting just allows all the meat juices to settle prior to carving. Carve into nice thick slices. And serve it with our lovely couscous.